In this video, you'll see how to add an announcement page to your website. Here's my Google site that I've created, and if you're an educator, you probably would want to make an announcements page for your class or maybe even for a club. To create an announcements page, go to the top and click on the New Pages icon. Now we'll give our page a name. I'm going to call it Announcement, but you don't have to. You could call it whatever you'd like. After you've typed in the name, then we need to select a template or what type of page we'd like it to be. If I click the down arrow right next to where it says Web Page, here are my choices. Web Page, Announcements, File Cabinet, or List. Well, let's choose Announcements. And we're going to select a location. We're just going to keep it at the top level. That makes the most sense for an Announcements page. And I'll click on Create. Now, on my website, I have an announcement page. And when you want to add an announcement to your page, you click on New Post. And at the top is the title for the announcement. You can type in the body what you want the announcement to say. When you're done typing in the announcement, then I'm going to click on Save. And underneath, we have the announcement. Let's say we want to add one more announcement. When you do that, you have to click on the announcement page itself, the beginning. And now we're going to click on New Post. And we'll say, uh, Every Student's Dream. Notice as you're typing in the body of the text that you have some of the same formatting options that you would have with a typical word processor. You can highlight text and you can change the size of the font, you can make it bold, you can change the alignment. So for now we're going to leave this as it is and I will choose save. And you have the way the announcements work is that the most recent announcement is at the top. And if I click on announcement, then we can see all of the announcements will start stacking up one on top of the next. And your students won't see this new post. That's just available to you because you're the author of this website. 